Well, we're starting uh, the vlog for the 14th and the 15th because our days run 24, so we're starting uh, just about an hour later at 5.30 on the 14th, Tuesday, the uh, July 14th. And we won't be finishing the vlog uh, here again until uh, Wednesday, July 15th, around 4 o'clock in the morning. So it goes. We do. I do operate. We do operate twenty four seven. I just finished watching Raquel. There was a uh, five uh, family five vlogs that I had missed. Uh, I watched the some uh, the Shumway show vlog, the Shumway vlog. Uh, they have a number of them. It was uh, it was um, Brighton's birthday, eleventh birthday. That's the 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 chronic gas. Uh, issue of 2020 the uh the great fart panic of 2020 has caused the people's birthday to shut down so you can't have your standard party what they do now is they have a drive-by just like you know your your, your standard drive drive your drive-by shooting now they have drive-by birthdays you know from the minds of politicians they release violent criminals and keep the ones who are non-violent in prison <laughs> That is it, of the minds of politicians. Anyways, uh, I've gotten up, I've shut, I've shut the front door, uh, reconfigured the system for the day. Typically what ends up happening is that uh, because you do have to do the cooling at night, and there's a number of different uh, work that has to be done on the computer at night uh, for some of the research that I'm doing, uh, I'm up all night long and Typically, the day doesn't end for me till around 6, 6.30 in the morning. Uh, so I end up hand, heading to bed. That's when I have my time off for bed. I have uh, from 7 till about noon off. And then I have to do some more computer work, uh, some more system work around noon. And then uh, I have, that takes me from noon till about 1 o'clock. And then I have another couple hours to uh, uh, to relax and to basically sleep, basically. So the sleep does is not in a row; it's, it's broken up. So I don't have a nighttime. This is what Clay Leah was doing. She was showing us her uh, uh, nighttime routine. She's up in Alaska. And then you, get, you get to see with the, with, with uh, the different vlogs, you get to see where they go. And she went up to Alaska. And they went on the glaciers. And she was in an RV. Once, if I get back up to my RV, so probably months later, probably in October, I'll give you a tour of my RV. But otherwise, it's here. It's the research facilities. It goes 24-7, and there really isn't a break. And so there's no morning routine, no night routine, and this is how. So this is what I had a problem before. I really didn't know how to set the vlogs properly because there isn't a day and there isn't a night. There isn't an end to the day. So, so it, one day runs into the next. So how do you do a daily vlog when there is no standard day? So uh, we'll do it this way. Start here and we end here. That's that way that this is our start point and this is our end point. Uh, so it's about an hour difference between. We ended at 4.30. It's now 5.42. The sun is now up. That's when I have to shut the door because the sun uh, adds uh, heat to the... Uh, uh, the, uh, the the front room which is uh, uh, eastward facing the air comes through to the back and out the back door so I've got that configured so it, it, enough cool air there's enough of a cool pool in the back in my, in my warehouse that it sucks the heat through and out the back door and there goes the sound there goes the Bluetooth sound system so what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna watch your sister or, uh, they're from the Ohana. This is these are two girls from the Ohana venture. I watched them as well, uh, as long as the Shumway. Uh, I haven't gotten to uh, to uh, uh, eight passengers yet. Uh, we'll see what if I get there. I got about a half hour left before I have to go do the gaming work, uh, and um, we'll see what happens. Well, it is just about uh, seven thirty in the morning. I just finished watching uh, Josh Jordan. Uh, I finished and caught up with uh, Raquel. 
She did. She did a, lot of, a number of uh, similar videos to her sister, um, Cleolea, but she didn't go camping. That is, I don't think she went up to Alaska. So she might be there, but she just hasn't uh, posted the video yet. So we'll see uh, if she's done that. The the last video I just watched, the last uh, uh, vlog I just watched, uh, Just Jordan, they were out camping. So uh, everyone has these trailers and. They go camping and <laughs> have their fun. But for me, I have my fun here. I sit outside every, at night. I bring a large chunk of the fun, the outdoors here. Well, where I am. And then, uh, have my fun throughout the day. So, how, you know, the, the question is, that, that sort of put the question of the day in here. What would you do if your life turned in such a manner that you'd leave, you're, you're going to be living your tween years, between 8 and uh, 13 or 8 and 14, if you were going to live them for the rest of your life, you're gonna, you'd, you'd always be within that age range, sort of going back and forth. Going in a circle like this from one point to the next point and then back again is known as oscillation. So what happens if you were the oscillating time warp where you're always between the ages of 8 and uh, 14 and you go from one to the next and then back again? If that was your life, what, in, in other words, you had to live your, you could live your between years and middle school years for the rest of your life, how would you do it? So that's kind of the question and uh, interesting to see how people answer it. Well, it's about 3 o'clock in the morning, and I'm just about ready to go in and uh, start the next part of my day. I ended up going to my parents' house for dinner, uh, got some ingredients for a, a cookie that I want to make over the weekend, now that the, everything's back working normally again in terms of the baking. So I'm baking a batch of cookies, uh, a, Greek, a Greek batch of cookies. And it requires, instead of using um, vanilla extract, you actually use the, ooze, use the, uh, uh, the drink ouzo. So it will have a liquid type of uh, flavor to it. Not a lot strong, but enough to make it distinct. And so uh, it's good dunked in coffee or stuff like that, or, or things like that. So it's good, it's good for breakfast or for... Uh, uh, a more substantial snack than just simply uh, uh, chips or something like that. And that's kind of the stuff that I like. And I, I make my own stuff. But it's been it, it's been interesting. I'm I'm gonna have a, a delivery tomorrow, food delivery. I don't know if I'll be able to film it. We'll see what happens if I can get the video of that. Because oh, usually, like, time, the things the things are time sensitive because they come in cold. And you only have a certain amount of time to get them into the fridge before uh, they start going bad. So uh, I don't know if I'll have enough time to actually uh, film uh, what I get. I, if, I, if I can, I will. Uh, if I if I can't, I won't. It really sort of depends on uh, on what happens. Anyways, what we're gonna do is gonna go in. We'll talk. We'll watch some of the vlogs and. Uh, I'll make my comments along the vlog. But otherwise, I've, I've got the first episode done. It's edited. Uh, I'm going to work on the second episode tonight. I'll do the editing for the second episode. And uh, this is going to be uh, the third episode. So, yay for that. I do have to do some organizing to make sure I know what episode is what. <laughs> and then uh, that should give me enough... Uh, of a leeway that if something goes wrong or I can't vlog for a day or so that uh, it won't be too bad uh, in terms of uh, of trying to catch up okay that's my TV it's a nice projector I think it's about 80 inches went to project it uh, so it's nice and large uh, I'm watching it off of YouTube and I typically use a browser rather than using uh, uh, the YouTube app. So that's this is my enjoyment. I'm on to the Leroy's next. This will give you some idea of the size of the screen. So this is what I'm watching. 
Uh, the whole setup cost me about a hundred dollars, so not bad. I had placed the I had a smaller TV there, uh, much smaller, and since this the, the new setup only cost me a hundred, which was cheaper than buying something new. That's what I got. So I'm happy with this is the Leroy that's Kesley there, uh, showing us some new shorts and uh, I think a top. Well, that was Leroy's, and we've come to the end of today's video, and I think I'll take the refrain uh, from the Yaoi Vlogs is, even if you don't think we're worth it, no refunds. <laughs> yeah, it's 4.50 in the morning. Um, we'll be starting again within an hour, just about 6 o'clock. Uh, the day will start again. Uh, we're moving on to Our Family Nest is next. Uh, followed by uh, Family 5 Vlogs, and then we'll go from there to see what else we're going to end up watching. Uh, it's nice and relaxing. Uh, the day is going to be a little kind of screwed up because uh, we, and we as a, we are Cyborg Alpha. Uh, we are waiting for delivery uh, probably around 2 o'clock in the afternoon, and that kind of puts the schedule off in terms of... Uh, well, what I do during the day, if I'm expecting a del if we're to, if we're expecting a delivery, uh, that kind of puts the uh, the the, uh, the schedule into a we'll call a flex mode or, or or a flux mode, where it changes. It's it's fluid, not specifically fixed. But it does come to pass, and then after that, it's get back to my no we get back to our uh, normal schedule. I have to be, get used to talking about we rather than I or me. Uh, because we are Cyborg Alpha.